So I've got the boys out again. This will be the last time they can come on here now until it's properly finished because they're coming to spray it off tomorrow. But it's a nice day and I thought, well, they're in the stable because the, uh, Apollo's going on a 24 kilometre event tomorrow. So I thought I'll just let them have a little graze out here. Of course, I have to watch them very closely because we have got rhododendrons about and also some grass clippings, which both are not good for the horses. Well, rhododendrons are very poisonous and uh, grass clippings, they can ball up inside the horse. And, um, well, I think they can be fatal if you let them have too many. So I have to keep my eye on them. I just thought I'd just show you. There they are, out in the sunshine. I've had a little canter about prior to me getting the camera, but I seem to have settled down now. For the, there's a bit longer grass over that side. So I think they prefer that. A bit less lawnish. I just have to have a look, make sure a Farouk isn't eating anything you shouldn't be around that corner because I can't see him. I can't wait until we get this into a proper little paddock for them. I'm so excited about it. I just wanted to show you this emergency stop in extra slow motion. Incredible. Somebody shooting in the distance. Yeah. 
Like he's just keeping an eye on them, aren't you? Yes, just keeping an eye on those boys, make sure they're not doing anything they shouldn't be. <laughs> aren't you? That's right. Don't you eat that! Apollo. They've got quite a bit of post and rail up, just got the round the corner to do and then that will be finished. three weeks since the lawn grass was sprayed with weed killer and it's all nicely browned off and dead. Well, I, I got supervising and then we got the audience in the, in the background. Rather him backing it in than me. I'll never be able to get that in there. To be frank, I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, yes. 
He is getting there. Oh, yes. No. No, no can't do it. Oh, I'll be oh. Okay. We are going to put a circular patio down where the tree stood and then put the patio set on top. We asked the contractor not to spray the area where the daffodil bulbs were. trying to save some daffodil bulbs and some bluebell bulbs if we can. That's all for now, folks. Thanks for watching. TTFN.